Hi, and welcome to LMTS.com. Here in this video, we're going to submit a request for a rate quote for a customer. So if you go to LMTS.com, click on the Customers tab. Here you jump to the Customers page on the right-hand side under the Customer menu. Say, Request a rate quote. Here it'll take you to the first part of the rate quote form. Just to put in basic contact information, my name is Emmett Brown. I am the owner of my company. It is Brown Industries. My email address is ebrown at brownindustries.com. Phone number is 123. I don't have a fax number, so I'm not going to put one. Here is a basic comment section if you wanted to put any other additional information, maybe extra contact information. I'm just going to leave that blank for right now. I have nothing else to say. And just go ahead and click Next. And here it takes you to the second part where you can put in the, the detail information of the shipment or shipments. Let's see, I have multiple shipments. Uh, they can start today. It will already preload with today's date. Here's a calendar if you need to select a date in the future. And it's picking in Los Angeles, we'll say California. Delivers on the 19th in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Right here, it's what we mean by produce versus dry freight. Produce is something you need uh, refrigerated equipment to haul, like fruits, vegetables, meats of sorts. Um, dry freight really is anything outside of that. So, you know, machinery, equipment, certain LTL things, stuff you need, either a dry van or a covered van, flatbed, a step deck. That's what we mean by dry freight. So in this instance, I do mean dry freight in a... Here's where you can list your commodity or commodities, depending on how much product is going on the truck. I just have one thing, it's flux capacitors. Uh, and for those of out there who are getting this reference, you know, more power to you. Uh, weight is 5,000 pounds. It's a light load. Value is 100 grand. It's an expensive load. And I'd say I have five shipments. Equipment, if you don't know 100% what equipment you might need, you can just kind of take your best guess. We're going to contact you and talk you through some options anyway, but I'm pretty sure I just need a dry van or a covered van. And then finally down here, if you know what LMTS division you want to send this to, you can select to do so. Uh, East Coast Produce is loads originating from the East Coast versus West Coast. And then dry freight is obviously anything that's not produce. And our nursery division really just means Chester, South Carolina. Uh, obviously, mine is a dry freight, so I'm just going to go ahead and send it to them. Um, one more point about this form is if you have multiple picks or multiple drops, you can kind of see right here, it means the very first pick or very last drop, like a lot of stuff coming from California, will pick up in several locations in California before finally dropping in, let's say, Jessup, Maryland or something like that, or vice versa. Uh, you'll put the very first pick and the very last drop right here. Other than that, we're all set. Let's click Submit. It'll jump you to this confirmation page right here. You can always go back to the form and edit some information and resubmit it. But beyond that, you're all set. If you have any other questions or comments about the form, you scroll down to the bottom, you can click Contact Us, and it'll jump to the Contact Us page. Fill out the simple form, and we'll get it immediately. Or you can give us a call at 1-800-632-3030 or email us at sales at lmts.com. Thanks for watching.